and we'll continue our good week by being just five uh, maybe seven minutes late ah but you know what makes me sad that I have to go in there in a classroom without windows so I don't even see the Sun I mean I don't care if I don't stay outside because it's freaking cold but man I love the Sun and I'm awake but so now assuming these are the right? resume with our lab session as yesterday. Okay. If it's not clear, and then everyone can use the last one. It's like eight or ten minutes. This is not a window, this is a glass wall. Also if you look out the window and you see the slides, it's not a window. <laughs> Man, I hate being in rooms without windows. <laughs> ah, the nice sound of man at work. Hashtag sexist. Ah, and the nice background of red leaves with a almost as purplish red hoodie thing. Yeah, make some noise. <laughs> In other news, later today we will get to see the computing center where Astra lives. So that should be interesting and I hope I can film there. Oh, they're moving! Things I do during the break while others are smoking, recording video. Mmm, <laughs> I just had prawn wraps really good like they turned out way better than I expected because the last few times I made similar things it was always kind of boring but this time it was really good so I need to remember how I did that I can also make a video about it because whenever I'm excited about something I want to make a video about it let me know if you would be interested in another cooking with Andy video <laughs> all right now I'm already nah, kind of late not really late I'm, I'm perfectly in time uh, for the afternoon session where we're gonna see Astral Astral because of the high power use they make and the amount of heat they put out we can't get it all in one rack. Physically, you can get, fix it into about two racks because of the heat output. It distributes that out across the room. 20 nodes in that area. So each one of these, one of these racks has got four nodes stacked in them side by side. Each node has 16 cores. The lines across the bottom, that's the parallel file system. There's about 34, 35 terabytes of storage. So there's lots of cables here, providing multiple pathways between them. It's just a bunch of ordinary servers. At least it's nice and warm in here. <laughs> All right, now we saw that thing. Not as impressive as CERN, obviously. <laughs> because I saw a pretty large computing center there back in the days when I was there. Um, Astra is already four years old. Basically, it consists of four racks, where it's just the lower part is filled because uh, the ventilation, the cold air comes from the bottom um, and is blown up behind the rack to the top again. And behind the rack is really warm. They said they have 18 teraflops it specified for 20 but 18 is the best they've got um, which is okay I mean for a four-year-old system you know for four-year-old academic system it's okay they will replace it this year so next March uh, there will be a new system and it will cost a few million pounds <laughs> so yeah those things are expensive man expensive and now I have basically 40 minutes to kill before my classes start don't know what I'm doing but you know there will be something uh, step one putting my jacket back on and step two telling you to make your backup and that I'll see you tomorrow